friends, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Naturally Eve and today I'm back again with another product review. Today we're going to be reviewing Shea Moisture's Jamaican Black Castor Oil Shampoo, Conditioner, as well as their Deep Conditioner. So if you're interested, keep watching. So starting off with the Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Shampoo. So this shampoo is actually sulfate free, which we love to see that. And the star ingredient is Jamaican Black Castor Oil. This is meant to be a clarifying shampoo and it's meant to remove buildup without stripping the hair of moisture. Um, some key ingredients here, all really good. But the, the first few ingredients are actually cleansing agents. We also have some essential oils, glycerin, which is a great conditioning agent. And there is also protein. There's two types of proteins here, rice protein and vegetable protein. So if protein is something that you're sensitive to, you definitely want to take a note of that. So I did actually pre-shampoo my hair using my favorite pre-shampoo by African Pride, the Moisture Miracle one. Uh, I always want to pre-shampoo my hair before actually going in with a clarifying shampoo just to make sure my hair doesn't feel so, so dry after. All right, we are done shampooing. Here's how my hair looks after the shampoo so i definitely feel like my hair is very shiny now again we did use a pre-shampoo so um that also plays a part because this is a clarifying shampoo and i feel like if you use it without a pre-poo or some kind of treatment before shampooing it might be drying so I'll try that as well and see how it goes. But so far, so good. Like my hair definitely feels clean. And when I was shampooing, I only focus on my scalp. So just my roots and my scalp. And I just wash it off. And as it washes off my hair, it will wash off the rest, the length of my hair. So yeah, so, so far, so good. My hair still feels soft and shiny and still good. I like it. So next we have the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Rinse Out Conditioner. So this conditioner looks white here, but the one that I got and most of the ones on the website are actually brown, so not sure why. But anyway, this is actually supposed to add moisture back into your hair without weighing it down. So I did follow up with this conditioner right away, and I really like the ingredients. The first few ingredients are super, super moisturizing. We have coconut oil, sterile alcohol, settle alcohol, Alcohol. Both are really, really good and they're at the top of the ingredient list, which we love to see. Here it is. I've already used quite a bit of this. I, I actually really like this stuff. I used it during my transitioning journey. So it's almost done. This is actually a bonus size. I think it was like on sale or something. Um, but the regular size is not, definitely not this big. Um, but yeah, let's see how it does. So usually when you want to apply conditioner, you definitely want your hair to be... Um, a little bit damp or even wet actually. So I'm actually using a spray bottle. It's just like a mist type of spray. I really like it. I got it at Diva Curl back when they weren't canceled, but you can get it like on Amazon or any like uh, beauty supply store. As usual, we want to section our hair so that it's easier for us to manage. conditioner it basically it smells like play-doh and i do smell a little bit of peppermint like the shampoo definitely like i smelt the peppermint when i was washing my hair this one is definitely more like play-doh but it's like a pleasant smell I, I i'm not mad at it like i like it but yeah the color is like a light beige brownish type so let's apply it to our first section So right away, I can actually detangle, which is really, really impressive. Like this conditioner detangles really, really well. I'm just gonna apply a little bit more because you know, who applies a dime size of anything, girl? <laughs> First section done. That was really easy. Like very, very easy. 
I didn't even have to divide up my sections. Of course, my hair is like wet. So that definitely, definitely helps. All right. Do you see this? I mean, girl, look at that. Let's continue with the rest of our sections. All right, so I'm gonna leave this on for about 10 minutes and then I'm gonna rinse it out and then we're gonna apply our deep conditioner. And we're back. So I just washed out all the conditioner. My hair feels very, very soft. And as you can see, it's very shiny too. The curls feel very, you know, hydrated and strong. Let me show you the back. So here's the back. Yeah, so, so far so good. I'm really actually loving my hair. Curls definitely feel, you know, hydrated, bouncy. Yeah, really, really good. So next we have Shea Moisture's Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Treatment Mask. So this mask is supposed to strengthen, of course, and restore uh, your hair's resilience. It's especially good for damaged, brittle, or chemically processed hair. So it looks like it's good for all hair types, both relaxed and natural. Same thing, the ingredients are also really, really good. Um, we have water, cetereal alcohol, great conditioning agent, glycerin. Um, there is behentrimonium methyl sulfate, which is a really, really good conditioning agent as well. Behentrimonium chloride. And there is also some protein in this mask as well. So here it is. So the whole line has a similar kind of aesthetic. It's all like kind of... Um, like a brownish color. This one smells exactly just like the conditioner. So it definitely smells like Play-Doh, but it's definitely like a pleasant smell. I definitely like the smell. And it looks pretty thick as well. She thick thick. This, the texture or the consistency is very buttery as well. Um, the texture of this one compared to the conditioner is definitely way thicker and very buttery. So. A little will definitely take you a long way. And if you have thin hair, you definitely don't need to apply too much. As usual, what do we do? Section our hair, boo. Then apply just a little bit at a time, starting at my roots and working my way up. All right, so already, this is a great detangler. Now, we did use a pre-shampoo and we also used a conditioner. So yeah, I would be surprised if we didn't detangle very easily, but for sure, um, I can already tell this is a great detangler. So I'm gonna apply a little bit more just to make sure every curl gets some love and just rake it through my hair. Uh, my hair, I feel like thrives on deep conditioning and I always want to put as much as I can um, with deep conditioners just to get the full, full benefit. So as you can see, my hair is just drenched in the deep conditioner. So now 
now that we're done applying the deep conditioner to all four sections, I'm just gonna put my hair up into a pineapple. Also, whenever you deep condition, you always wanna apply some heat to the hair. So this basically helps open up your hair cuticles and really absorb the full benefits of the mask that you're applying. You can either use a hot cap. So I have this hot cap. Um, I just got it from Amazon, I think. This particular one actually has flax seeds inside. And basically I pop this in the microwave, it heats up and that's my heat for my deep conditioner. But you can also sit under a hooded dryer um, as well. I know they also have some gel um, caps as well that basically same thing you put it in the microwave and the gel heats up so either way it doesn't matter as long as you apply some heat so i'm gonna pop this in um and then i'm just gonna let my hair sit for like 40 minutes to about an hour to really get the full benefits of the deep conditioner and we're back let's wash this off This is how my hair looks after the deep conditioning mask. My hair definitely feels really, really soft. It feels moisturized, strong, bouncy, honey. Let me just show you a little close up. So overall, I definitely love this Jamaican uh, black castor oil line. I would say if you had to get a product, I would get the clarifying shampoo because you know you always need a clarifying shampoo and the deep conditioner. I don't think I would repurchase the conditioner just because it's just so similar to the deep conditioner. And if I have to pick between a conditioner and a mask, I will definitely go for the mask or the deep conditioner. Thanks again for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so I can continue to make amazing videos. Until next time, keep it naturally.